The Shea Specialty Thin Film Division presents the benefits and design rules of the filled via technology. Filled vias are an alternative to plated through holes, where the drilled hole is completely filled and then planarized. The Shea Specialty Thin Film offers pure gold filled vias, copper filled vias, and polyamide filled vias. Why filled vias? Filled vias offer a low inductance, low resistance, microwave grounding path through the substrate. They create a thermal path for high powered devices in temperature critical applications. Vias provide a two sided signal interconnection, eliminates epoxy or solder bleed through during assembly, and reduces assembly costs and reduces piece part count by eliminating the need to mount active die to the package floor. The Shea EFI's gold filled vias are produced through a plated process resulting in a pure gold fill material. Gold filled vias have the conductivity of the bulk metal because unlike thick film vias, they do not contain any frit or binders. They provide superior electrical and thermal paths. The Shea Ultrasource's Ultra Via is a pure gold filled via that is directly bonded to the ceramic hole. Ultra vias are space qualified. The Ultravia also is highly conductive and has an extremely reliable electrical and thermal path. The copper filled via is a pure copper filled material that is directly bonded to the ceramic via. The copper filled via is also highly conductive but can be lower in cost than the pure gold options. However, it is not compatible with all metal systems. The poly via is a filled via that is filled with polyamide rather than pure metal. The purpose of the polyvia is to be used in the plated through hole designs in order to stop epoxy or solder bleed through during assembly operations. The polyvia exhibits excellent adhesion and thermal stability to gold and other thin film metals. The polyvia is a much lower cost option for applications only looking to stop epoxy or solder bleed through. The first step in incorporating vias into the substrate design is choosing the via diameter. The proper via size is dependent upon the desired substrate material and substrate thickness. For Vache, the allowed ratio range is from a minimum of 0.6 times the substrate thickness to a maximum of 1.5 times the substrate thickness. The second step of designing with vias is the via layout. Vias must be spaced apart from each other a distance of two times the via diameter from center to center. Vias must be a minimum of 2.5 mils away from the circuit's edge. Each via needs a capture pad or annular ring that is at least 2.5 mils larger per side than the via's diameter. Also, if a via vent is required, the via vent edge to pattern edge must be at least 4 mils. The third step is the via modeling. A via hole in a custom substrate can be viewed as a series RL circuit with the resistance and inductance values being a function of via metallurgy and geometry. The via height and diameter are determining parameters when designing circuits. More information on filled vias can be found on the Vachet website. Thank you.